Hey guys, Shrapnel here. Gonna do a quick video on my MacGyver kit. It's It has tools that I don't necessarily need on a regular basis, but it just makes sense for me to have. I'm basically the handyman of my friend group, and more importantly, I'm the handyman of my family. I'm constantly fixing things like door handles that are loose, or putting on the new cover for the light switch, and nonsense like that and sometimes delving into a little bit of automotive. So I've, I've kind of broken it down to the tools that I need the most on a regular basis. Well, again, like I said, not necessarily a regular basis, but tools that I need for when those situations arise. It's in a uh, nylon Leatherman sheath. So it's like the one that came, comes standard with the Wave. It cost me like 10 bucks at Cabela's. Because the one that came with my rebar just does not offer the capacity that I was looking for. And I have one of those night eyes like cell phone cases, but that one it hangs too far off of my belt for me to work with. So let's get started. Main tool is the Leatherman rebar. I love this thing. It has basically all the tools I need and nothing I don't. The only tool I could po probably live without, no well, tools, is the saw blade and the fully serrated blade. I just do not need those. Everything else I do use pretty regularly. Up next is a roughly four inch adjustable wrench. It's not gonna get into much but it's good for tightening maybe a uh, car battery, terminal, a di uh, connector, or whatever. Or unscrewing a small bolt from a vent or something. So, that's why I have it. It doesn't weigh too much. Sorry, I'm losing my voice a little. And it just went downhill fast. So let's get this done quick. There we go. I have a Thrunite TI-3. It's got four modes, low, medium, high, and strobe. And then last but certainly not least is a small, very basic, minimal field sharpener. It's, it's not my preferred item to use, but if I need a quick edge just because I dulled mine and I don't want to forget that it's damaged, I'll use this real quick just to get it back up to snuff. I wouldn't want to use it on my Benchman 940, but if I had to, I would. It's mainly for sharpening this. I don't care about the blade on this all that much. Because I don't access it that much. And if the blade on this goes downhill, I got two others. As a backup to this kit, I also have my uh, Wanger, I don't even know what this is called, I think it's like the Highlander or something. It certainly does the trick. My favorite style, I can't open it. Anyways, I'm getting off topic. So, Leatherman Rebar, 4 inch adjustable wrench, small flashlight, and field sharpener. That's what's in my little kit. It kind of falls into the category of urban survival kit, but not really. This is more of an EDC thing. If it was to be an urban survival version, I'd upgrade a lot of the equipment. Larger flashlight, larger multi-tool, larger wrench. A proper sharpener, maybe. Nah, probably not. This gets most of my work done. Because if you wear out one side, just take a Torx wrench to it and spin it around. So yeah, that's my uh, MacGyver kit. If yeah, that's what I'm, the name I'm gonna go with. That's uh, what I've been calling it when I was building it. So yeah, thanks for watching.